gives you a kind of perspective so that you put your energy in things that make sense. If you are creative enough not only to make solutions for your audience or to make only solutions for a company but it's not interesting, you have to make solutions, you have to create things which are good for all the people involved. To power, to policies, to economy, to financial issues, to social issues. I think that you know, this, this notion of the new economy uh, in design is, is and, and design being the new economy and creativity being the new economy is definitely happening. I believe that design must also be rooted in its place. So it can transcend and resonate to other people, but it really must be part of its place. And I think South Africa's place has to deal with issues of a fractured society, uh, a nation in healing, uh, a nation in contestation. And if, if designers are really going to make a better world, you know, it's not just about designing a better tea party. I think one of the strongest things in South Africa is design. There's some, some extra innovation required on the part of many different uh, designers, entertainers, um, artists to produce what, what, what is produced here. People these days are understanding that great ideas don't live in prepackaged places. And I saw that there was an opportunity to develop something that had more of an African aesthetic. Especially given the fact that there is such a strong aesthetic on the continent. The hardest thing that anybody can do is to keep a point of view, a unique point of view. And that's what gives um, a designer an edge. A chance to, uh, to find out the uh, new challenge through our creation. It's the idea of making art as a kind of social process or a, a kind of an uh, edifying sort of uh, strategy. Community art has been brought into buildings, back into architecture, partly as a way of creating a sense of ownership by using local artists. And How incredibly beautiful is it that we live in a society where grown up people like myself are able to wake up Monday morning, pick up a pencil, and just make funny little drawings. And our culture loves that so much that they are willing to keep us alive also. It's not only an opportunity, it's a responsibility. It seems that the only way that we can really create change is through talent. There is more um, effort to help others, to, um, to help the world, to, to create your own work, but also co-create with others to somehow solve some problems. When you hear that we're going to design life, that's pretty amazing. Well, I'm going to talk to you about uh, designing new life. So, uh, part of writing the genetic code is part of new design. The world is waiting for African design and South African design. You know, I often get asked, do I have a favorite or do I have a best ad? And I always have the same answer. Yes, it's the one I'm working on now. We all walk around with art objects on our head and on our bodies and so on, which communicate different worlds to each other. Um, so these are all invitations to each other to try this world out.